Matt Panto here from the Fenning Alumni Center on the Lafayette campus as we get set to preview the 2013 Patriot League Men's Basketball Championship as Lafayette men's basketball team defeated Lehigh in the semifinals on Saturday afternoon for the third time this season. Now they will go to take on Bucknell in that championship game Wednesday night out in Soika Pavilion, Lewisburg, Pennsylvania at 7.30 p.m. The game is available on the CBS Sports Network. We suggest just buying a ticket right now from the athletic ticket office and making the two-hour trek out to Lewisburg. Coach O'Hanlon along with seniors Tony Johnson and Levi Geese and freshman Bryce Scott just wrapped up their media luncheon to preview Wednesday night. Let's take a look at what each of them had to say. You know a couple weeks ago I guess we met here it's an exciting time of year you know playing in the, in, in the postseason and with each passing game it seems like the stakes get a little higher. Um, I thought we had a tremendous you know game overall against Lehigh um, and Lehigh is a very good basketball team obviously the defending champions. Um, the part of the start of the second half, we broke it open. We jumped off to a 16 point lead. Um, I thought that, you know, they showed a lot of heart, which you expect from a team like that. They got back in the game, cut it to five. But uh, two things, we shot foul shots very well. We did a good job protecting the basketball. We have Tony Johnson to, to calm us down. And uh, those factors, I think, really entered into it as we uh, came down the stretch. Yeah, I mean, when you lose in a championship game, especially against a team like Bucknell, Bucknell kind of tends to stick with you. Um, it's kind of nice, it's almost like a little bit of revenge. I mean, uh, there's nothing like playing a championship game. Obviously, it's going to be a hostile crowd. They always bring a lot of fans out. You know, a couple weeks ago, I guess we met here. It's an exciting time of year, you know, playing in the, in, in the postseason. And with each passing game, it seems like the stakes get a little higher. Um, I thought we had a tremendous, you know, game overall against Lehigh. Um, and Lehigh is a very good basketball team. Obviously, the defending champions. Um, the part of the start of the second half, we broke it open. We jumped off to a 16-point lead. Um, I thought that, you know, they showed a lot of heart, which you expect from a team like that. They got back in the game, cut it to five. But uh, two things, we shot foul shots very well. We did a good job protecting the basketball. We have Tony Johnson to, to calm us down. And uh, those factors, I think, really entered into it as we uh, came down the stretch. There's a lot of urgency. Um, we st I've started every game. I've been a little nervous. You know, first couple of minutes is always uh, a little um, emotional. But once you get into the game, you start to settle down and um, start to play basketball the way you're taught. A couple of things. I think you get in those situations, and I know Bryce has been in those situations before. Um, it, if you're concentrated on the shot, it never changes. It's always 15 feet. You've got to block things out and just concentrate on making the shot. And I think sometimes you just concentrate even more knowing, you know, how, how important it is uh, that you have to make those shots. And um, stepping up to the line, making 10 in a row like he did uh, is certainly a credit. But I, I've seen, I'm sure if you watch Bryce in practice, he'll make 100 in a row. He's certainly capable of doing that. Uh, stakes are a little bit higher, uh, but he, he did a great job with that. Really, um, I feel like we try to approach every game the same way. We try to play our best every game, and um, it's been really nice having teammates like I got here, so, you know, Tony and Levi. Um, kind of just remind you that it's just a game, and that we just got to play hard every game, and if we play that way, um, you know, we're sure that the outcome will be the way we want it to. Well, he's not, obviously he's not easy, and, and the fact that they do have an inside presence like Muscala, you know, you have to help out. You can't let Mscow play one on one inside. So, for all of us, Cameron Ayers and Bryson Johnson, and Bryson Johnson is one of the better shooters in our league. Um, you have to know where he is at all times. But you, you know, you can't get away from your principles uh, uh, of helping Dan when you have to, and and finding Bryson. Um, you kind of pick your poison when you're playing a, a Bucknell. The, you know, do you want to double Mscow and let some of these great shooters? Uh, uh, free or play up on Bryson Johnson and give, you know, Muscala a lot of room to work. Um, you know, I, I, I don't have an answer. I asked some of you guys afterwards if you could help me out with that, you know. Uh. Um, I mean, it's obviously there's nothing like playing at home. You know, everybody's on our side at home and uh, makes it a little bit more difficult for the, the opponents to play. But, um, I mean, I think our guys um, are just so confident that I think they'll probably try to stay focused and kind of just kind of leave all the fans and everything, you know, keep keep their minds straight. And, uh, I mean, when you have shooters like a Bryce and Levi, Seth, Joey, I don't think that bothers them in the least bit. 
So there you have it, Coach O'Hanlon and three of our student athletes previewing Wednesday night's Patriot League Championship game out at Bucknell. A reminder for students, you can purchase your game and bus voucher right now on GoLeopards.com, exclusively on GoLeopards.com. And also for the Lafayette community, the rest of the Lafayette community, you can purchase your tickets right now through the athletic ticket office. Stop down into Kirby Sports Center or call 610-330-5471. Lafayette has a very limited allotment left of game tickets, so I suggest doing that here on Monday afternoon. For our schedule for the next couple of days, we will have a practice report from Kirby Sports Center tomorrow afternoon on Tuesday. We'll also travel out with the team and have a report from the team hotel Tuesday evening and a report from Shoot Around inside Soika Pavilion on Wednesday afternoon. All the nonstop coverage you need to get you ready for Wednesday night at 7.30 p.m. as the Leopards take on the Bison in the 2013 Patriot League Championship. Until tomorrow afternoon, go Leopards, beat the Bison. <laughs>